guys so welcome to today's vlog um we just got to new york city we're actually here for um, my husband's business trip and i just pretty much tagged along we've been traveling all morning so my hair is a mess i have no makeup on i look tired and all that stuff but we're just really hungry so we're gonna go down and get something to eat at the restaurant down here um they ended up putting us in a double bed because the king bed actually got flooded or something um but they'll move us later on during our trip um the room is pretty small but you know new york standard but it's still nice nonetheless oh my god i look a mess that's cool just wanted to show you guys the view Okay, New York. All right, so, oh, this is better lighting, kind of. Um, all right, so we're gonna go down and get something to eat. My hair, oh my God, wrecked. I look wrecked right now, I know. Anyways, um, yeah, we're gonna get something to eat and yeah, super excited about that because we didn't eat all day, just been flying, traveling, all of that. All right, see you later. <laughs> We are at the hotel's restaurant and we're getting something to eat because we're starving. We're getting impossible burgers. Those are my favorite. And yeah, we're gonna probably, I don't know if we're gonna walk around after this. Do you wanna walk out after this? Yeah. Um, but yeah, we definitely need to put some fuel in our stomachs <laughs> after an all day traveling and only having pretzels from the plane. So, yeah, that's what we're doing. It's freezing. So I got my jacket on, extra cover. This is what I am wearing. I tried to get you guys more back. Let's see if I can show you a little bit. Probably not. Um, I have on this long dress. I have on white sneakers because we'll be doing some walking. My husband's already down in the lobby. He's working at the like lounge terrace area and he got some breakfast but I was on the phone with my sister and yeah I didn't really feel like getting up um but yeah we're gonna get something to eat I think it's about like 11 30 a.m um yeah I need to finish I think I'm pretty much done it is a hot mess when I say hot, I mean a hot mess in this room, but whatever. Um, I only brought one perfume with me, and that is the Coco Mademoiselle. Um, this is like their travel whatever. So it comes in there, and then, you know, spray a little bit because I usually wear this at night, but it's the only scent that I have because it's my only travel one. Um, yeah, and I have my Christian Dior belt. Um, I do have my Gucci belt with the white, which would actually go with my sneakers, but I'm wearing that tonight. So yeah, not really wanting to wear that. I got this dress from Express. It's a sweater dress and it's like a maxi dress. It comes down like like above my ankle so not too far down but yeah um 
yeah so this is the look i just did my hair in a ponytail but just did my eyebrows and just light makeup with blush and some lip gloss and yeah so i'm probably oh i also have sunglasses i have my versace sunglasses which i love they're like a cat eye so i'll show you okay miss new york what's up so um i'll be bringing these um and then my jacket is gonna be the jacket i've been wearing it's this overcoat and yeah today we're actually gonna get some gloves and um probably a scarf because it's cold and on saturday we're going on like a night dinner cruise thing on um the hudson river so don't want to be freezing out there um i kind of need to like put things away and then go down i want to put some stuff in the safe and everything so when housekeeping comes but yeah all right I will get this room together and I will see you in the lounge. Yeah, that's where we're going. So, all right, so we are going to head downstairs. Love the view, super cute. Yeah. He's locked in. husband actually got locked on the terrace so I had to um, go and find someone to open that up for him and yeah so now I'm just waiting for him he's gonna put away his work laptop and get a jacket and then we're gonna go get some lunch because I'm hungry You guys can see my shoes. I only brought this bag and an evening bag because obviously I didn't know how to pack this time. But at least I have the white bag to go with my white sneakers. Um, yeah. Um, so the plan is to get something to eat and then get some gloves and a scarf. And yeah, I don't know what else we're doing. The dinner um, for the company is, I, I don't know if it's like six or something like that. So yeah, I don't know. I don't really know the schedule. I'm just tagging along. This is my husband's business trip and I'm just like, I want to go to New York too. And he's like, yeah, let's, let's do it. So the details of everything I don't really know but tomorrow night we're gonna go see Wicked which I'm really excited about we wanted to see Hamilton but we couldn't um, get any tickets that were sitting right next to each other and Wicked is like the number one um, Broadway show so we're like okay let's just go see Wicked I love fantasy I love Wizard of Oz love the wicked witches so um yeah so we're gonna see that and then on saturday we have that dinner cruise thing and then um sunday we leave and back in la so be fun um little trip that we have going on because you said that I always make a face. It's gross. So we're heading down to the pier. We just had an amazing lunch. Well, I had a lunch. He already ate when he was at the hotel. So I ate by myself and he just had an espresso. And now we're heading down to the pier. Oh, 
so we're about to leave for the dinner. I have on, you look nice. Um, let me try to sew tight in here. Okay, I have on, it's hard to see, but I have on red suit, I have my Chanel, and then I have the jacket. So I have a little red suit going on. So this is my look. I have on these heels. <laughs> it's hard to show you because everything. Sorry, my husband's waiting for me to finish being extra. But yeah, this is the final look. I'm obviously going to bring, wear my jacket on top of this. Oh, I do need lipstick. Where's my, I've been wearing my Charlotte Tilbury. Got this mini one. I got the full size one, but the mini one is fine. Okay. And yeah. I'm gonna just pop this jacket on on top of this. Me hot. Be cute. I'm gonna wear the jacket once I get downstairs when it's cold. All right, so this is the look. Make sure my hair okay. Okay. Yes. What do you think my look? Just perfect. Thank you. All right, he says I look perfect, so. Yeah, let's go. All right, so we are waiting for our car. I'm a little bundled up. Could just we could walk, but because I have on heels, he ordered a car. I'm trying to fix my jacket underneath. But yeah. So change of plans, we're walking. It's not that far, it's just a couple blocks away. And I can walk in here, so I'll be fine. Um, we can cross here. And then hurry up and cross. This room is a mess, but we're checking out of this room tomorrow and then we will check into another room at the same hotel. So, yeah. All right. Okay, so oh, what, what is this? What, what is this little piece of hair? Okay. All right, so we just got back from um, 
Well, I already said that part. Okay. Um, one thing about women that I already knew, but I think it just gets reinforced every single time, is that no matter what circumstance, room, situation, or anything, relationships always come up in women's conversation. Could be talking like that event was very professional, you know, we're talking all this stuff, but it always comes down to your relationship and people talk about their relationships. And yeah, I just am happy that I get to help people with their relationships. He's not listening to me. He's literally reading a book. Um, but I get to help people with their relationships and I really appreciate that because I see like successful, powerful women, even they, you know, still care about their relationships and, and their love lives and wh where they see that going. So I'm very happy and appreciative of the work that I'm able to do with you ladies who, you know, take advantage of it and, and you know, ask me to be a part of your journey. So I definitely appreciate that because I see how valuable and needed that is. Not to get sentimental, sentimental or anything like that. Just wanted to put that out there. So yeah, I'm gonna wipe my face off with these and then wash my face and then get, get to bed while he reads his John Grisham book, which I actually picked up for him. It's called The Rainmaker and yeah, so what all right guys he's done with me talking see you tomorrow let's see now oh. <laughs> Want to grab breakfast? Yeah, and I've got to work for a bit. Obviously, I don't know if you want to just kind of work in the lounge for a little bit together. Or... Put together our clothes. All right. Alright guys, so it's the next morning and we're going to change rooms from this double room to the king size room, which we originally had, but because we we're extending our stay, um, we do already have to change rooms. Um, yeah, but last night was so much fun. Um, we're about to go get some breakfast. We're gonna drop off our luggage um, with the front desk and then they'll, whenever the room is ready, they'll put our stuff in the room. And yeah, that's pretty much the plan. I thought we would go up to Central Park, but he's gotta work. So that's not gonna happen. Um, but we'll probably get lunch and stuff and we have to figure out where we're gonna go for dinner before the show because we want to be in that area before the show because I want to get dinner in that area before the show so that way we're not like starving while we're watching and you know, we'll be close by and don't have to like rush or anything after we eat. So that's on the agenda to get a reservation from for somewhere around there. And yeah, that's pretty much the deal today. Um, So 
we just got back to the hotel doing some work in the lounge right now and I'm just pretty much tallying up some expenses that um, my husband's making me do for the business. So, yeah. Fun. I'm a little tired. I like need another nap. But, yeah, this is what we're doing until our room is ready. Which is fine. I think I should have just brought my laptop though. Because working through my phone is kind of hard. So we are in Central Park right now and just going on a nice little stroll. I love being on the East Coast for autumn because you get to see the leaves changing and it's just so beautiful and full of autumn colors. And yeah, it's really, really nice just to get out here and walk around in nature. Um, so I need yeah, that's what we're doing. So happy we came out here. So we just got in our new room with the bed size that we wanted and now this is our view. Which is pretty nice but the nicest thing was this little note that was left here for us by the hotel. They were so kind and they um, apologized to us for not having our room type before and then they left us this and some water, some Voss water, which is actually sparkling water, which is really nice of them. We weren't even really complaining about the room. Um, let's see what this is. Let me open this up. And some chocolates. Oh, so sweet. That's really nice. So, yeah. Motto by Hilton and Chelsea. So, I don't know, guys, if you uh, want great service and check this place out. Not the biggest room, but it is very nice and comfortable enough. This room with the king definitely has more space than the one with the double. I felt really cramped in there. And at least here, we have more space here to like, you know, sit and stuff. So yeah, this is the little room. As you guys see me. Okay, yeah. So we're just gonna chill out and probably take a nap because I'm a little tired and then get ready for dinner and the show tonight. 
to see Wicked. So really excited about that. And excited about our room change. Alright, I will see you in a bit. Okay guys, so we are heading to dinner. I am just wearing this cute dress, my jacket blazer that I'm actually going to put my other jacket on top of um, my Chanel and I'm wearing let me try to show you my Louboutin Eloise Broda boots yeah and this is the look for this evening loving this fit so me so me all right I just put my hair up in an updo just to give it a little more fun tonight since I'm wearing kind of a little girly pop outfit. Alright, our lift is on the way and we're going to go to dinner before we go see Wicked. Super excited. Is the car already on its way? Six minutes. Oh, we have six minutes. So that'll give us enough time to get downstairs. Um... Actually, I need to bring my lipstick because I don't have this lipstick on me. So let me find that and then we'll go downstairs. All right. So the lift is here. the restaurant we're having dinner before the show this is like actually people lining up for the show so glad we got our tickets in advance um yeah let me show you the restaurant so we just finished dinner we're gonna close out and then the line to go to the show. Dinner was great. So happy we came here and that way we can like see how long you know it's gonna be to get inside. It, the line's still gone. So we're at an admission right now. The show is so good. Like, I almost broke out in tears because I'm always emotional, but I absolutely love musicals. And this one, I'm so happy we came. So good. I highly recommend it. If you are in New York, come see Wicked. It's really worth it. Um, right now, just in line for the restroom. And yeah, I'm really excited to see the second half. Yeah. All right. We went to go see that. Um, now, um, we're just walking like a block or so and then gonna get a car because it's crazy over here, as you may know. <laughs> but um, yeah, I highly recommend that show. I, I just love musicals. I'm obsessed and now I'm obsessed with Wicked. The only other show I've seen on Broadway has been Chicago and that was like when I was 18 years old. So I'm so happy to have seen this and I just wanna see more shows. I wanna see Hamilton, I wanna see so many more shows but we're leaving in two days. So I'm so happy we did this tonight and yeah, it was great, happy. We are on our way to downtown today. 
we're going to have brunch um, down there near the Brooklyn Bridge. So that's going to be nice. And then we'll just hang out a little bit down there, maybe do some shopping, I don't know, and then get back to the room in time to get ready for the boat because this is our final night here because we leave tomorrow. So should be a fun day very nice um it was pretty gray i mean it still is but it's like kind of breaking up a little bit so it looks a little better than it did earlier and yeah last night guys i didn't talk to you again after the show but we walked all the way from broadway like 51st street to 24th street through Times Square and all that chaos. So we walked however many blocks that is and I had on my Louis Vuitton boots. So, wow, <laughs> a lot, a lot, a lot. Yesterday, I think in total, we had like over 15, maybe 16,000 steps. So definitely getting my workout on here. All right, so I'll see you guys when we get to the restaurant. All right, so we made it down here. It's actually a pretty nice day. A lot going on for Christmas down here. And I'll show you. the Brooklyn Bridge. I don't think I've actually ever done this um, that I can remember. It's really beautiful. So many people, obviously. So we're about to go on the boat cruise. I was supposed to have tights on, but the top part of the tights were showing through my little skirt. These are actually, this is actually a skirt, skirt. So it's like pants in the back. Anyways, um, I feel a little bloated, but whatever. This is the outfit, this is the look I have on my same Louboutin boots again, because obviously I didn't learn my lesson and I didn't bring any other shoes for the night other than the boots. Um, have my diamond bracelet, diamond ring, diamond necklace, earrings. So, diamond, diamonds on me dance. Oh, okay, and I'm wearing this pretty Nina clutch that has these stones on the top handle, which is really cute. So that's my outfit. I'm gonna just throw on the same jacket that I've been wearing. We're gonna call the car and get there early because the last time we tried to do like one of those cruise ship things in San Diego, we missed it and couldn't get on the boat because we were like, I don't know, five, three minutes behind and they already, you know, boarded and everything like that. So this time we're gonna be extra on time even if we're early. So yeah, we're ready to go and have some fun tonight. So I'll see you guys once we get over there. Okay, so we got here a little early and it's okay because it's what we wanted. We have about 30 minutes. We're kind of just hanging out watching some people play basketball right now and staying warm. I don't actually have a scarf. This is a sweater that I'm using as my scarf because it's freezing and like I said, I don't have any tights on. So it's a cold night and we're on the water so it's gonna definitely be cold. 
Um, but we're excited. This has been such a fun trip. Oh my god, my lash looks so janky. Okay, let's just go with it. Um, this has been such a fun trip so far, and it's nice to do this at the end and just close out the the whole trip. Thank you for taking us. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're on the boat. Super excited. There's the food. <laughs> they gave us a nice little window seat so we'll be able to see a lot sitting here. Really, really cool and nice. So we are on the boat. We were like the first people to board. I think we probably were the first people to board. So that's really fun. We just finished eating dinner and you can see the Manhattan Bridge and the Brooklyn Bridge. So cool. Over here is Brooklyn. And then over here is Manhattan. It is freezing out here. The quality of this video is not that good, but it's so pretty out. We just got off the boat. It's freezing. And we're gonna go get our car. That was so much fun. Again, highly recommend if you're in New York, take the cruise at night and enjoy with your loved ones, with your friends. It's, it's really beautiful. And as you guys can see from the video, like you get really close to the Statue of Liberty. I think it was even closer than what I got on camera, but you get really close and you just get to like go down the Hudson to the East River. It's, it's highly recommended. Super fun. Um, yeah, so I'll talk to you guys once we get back to the room. Bye. Good morning. Now, today is the day that we leave. So we're all packed up and ready to go. This was an amazing trip, but it has to come to an end and we have to go back to LA. Um, before we go, we're gonna have a brunch at the Smith. My sister actually recommended us to go there. She says they have some great avocado toast and we're gonna go have that. We're gonna leave our bags, which are here at um, the front desk because our flight is not until like five something and they start boarding at like 4 45 so we have some time it's now like i think 10 30 yeah like around 10 30 so we have some time. our reservation is at 11 a.m so we're gonna walk over there it's not too far from here go have brunch come back pick up our bags and then head to the airport so that is the plan um New York was amazing, so happy and so grateful that I was able to come and tag along with my husband on his trip. Um, I'm just wearing some khakis, sweater, belt, white sneakers, just kind of going with that flow nice and easy. Um, my hair is a mess, <laughs> my eyelashes is a mess. Um, can't wait to get home, fix all of that, wash my hair, and just kind of get back into my routine. But yeah, love the trip, love New York, and yeah, thank you guys for staying tuned. All right, let's go to brunch. So we're here now, it's super loud. <laughs> oh. 
Delicious. I have the avocado toast. We have pancakes to share, and he has bacon and eggs with coffee. Okay, so we are at JFK, and this is the end of the vlog. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching, and I will see you in the next video.